I want to give you a little update on our uh, campaign to stand with Ukraine. We have raised over $20 million in less than a week. And I say we because it's all of us together. Some people haven't, didn't have the means to give, and they've done an unbelievable job of getting the word out and sharing it. But we're not done. Our goal is 30, and we're going to get there. But we do want to say thank you to the 56,000 of you who were able to donate and um, supported us. And whether it was the $5, the $10, the, the $1,000, whatever it was, means so much to us because it does bring in a community and a sense of belonging and, and a, an, an ability to help. Let's keep pushing. Let's keep spreading the word. And we, together, can hit our goal of $30 million. The first humanitarian aid is already on the ground. Flexport's already delivering planes that are, are delivering humanitarian aid to these NGOs, and Airbnb is already taking in refugees. There have been over a million children. This is just children that are in refugee status right now. And so every bit that we can do helps, and we appreciate you. Thank you. The Black Swan actress 38 and the No String Attached actor 44 have now raised over $20 million for the people of Ukraine following the unprovoked attacks from Russia. The Ukrainian born star and her husband announced the news in a video they post to Instagram. We want to give you a little update on our campaign to stand with Ukraine. Kutcher began in the video, we have raised our $20 million in less than a week. And I say we because it's all of us together. Some people did not have the means to give and they have done an unbelievable job for getting the word out and sharing it. But we are not done. Our goal is $30 million and we are going to get there. The friends with benefits start then took our for her husband saying but we do want to say thank you to the 56,000 of you who were able to donate and support it. We there it was the $5, the $10, the $1000, whatever it was it means so much to us because it does bring in a community and a sense of belonging and ability to help. Let's keep pushing, let's keep spreading the word and we together can hit our goal of $30 million. Kutcher said the first humanitarian aid is already on the ground, Flexport already delivering planes that and delivering humanitarian aid to these NGO and Airbnb is already taking in refuge. There have been over 1 million children. This is just children that are in refuse status right now. And so every bit that we can do help and we appreciate you. Kuchar captioned the post. Thank you to everyone that got us to $20 million in less than a week. We can do this. We can hit our goal together because we stand together with Ukraine. Kunis was born in Ukraine and moved to United States in 1991 when she was just 8 years old. Kuchir and Kunis launched the GoFundMe page last Thursday when she appeared alongside Kuchir in a video shared to his Instagram account. In the video, she spoke publicly for the first time about the devastating conflict in her native country. I was born in University Ukraine in 1983. I came to America in 1991. I have always considered myself an American. The actress began, I proud. I love everything this country has done for myself and my family. But today, I have never been more proud to be a Ukrainian. Kunis later said, the event that have unfolded in Ukraine are devastating. There is no place in this world for this kind of unjust attack on humanity. If you like the video, please like it and don't forget to subscribe my channel and turn on the notification bell so you get notification of all my upcoming videos.